G'day guys, welcome to Primal Waters. By now you would have seen or heard the story of a great white shark that was found in a abandoned wildlife park. Now I've seen this video probably about four weeks ago. There's a couple of them up there now. Uh, there's a couple of YouTubers I subscribe to who uh, call themselves urban explorers. And what they do is they go out to abandoned sites and explore it, film it and uh, share it on their YouTube videos. Now I can remember the, this one particular video, they've gone out to a place called Wonderland Wildlife Park and they're exploring the place. Now I'm not too sure how long ago this park was shut down but going by the footage of it, it's been a very, very long time. The place is falling apart. Um, it was shut down because apparently the park didn't have the right licences to um, have animals on display so it was shut down. The RSPCA took the animals and uh, these guys are checking it out, uh, I think they, it was uh, maybe in December or early this year, and uh, they've come across this room, and you could see signs uh, while they were going through, through there about a, a great white shark display, and uh, they would talk about it, and then they reached this room, which is uh, very dark, and there's a lot of litter and um, stuff around, and they come across this big tank, um, and uh, they're not too sure what's in there. Uh, until one of the guys go on to the opposite side of it, shine a torch through it, and you see this silhouette of a great white shark, which is quite astonishing. So this shark's been sitting out there for so long, it's been abandoned, and uh, the problem is at the moment, I guess, is that vandals have started to make their way out there, and they've chucked chairs in, TVs in, and stuff like that, which is very, very disappointing. Now, the story behind the shark, apparently, is that the shark is called Rosie. It's a four-metre, I guess, female great white shark that was caught back in 1998 um, off the Victorian coastline. It was accidentally caught, well, accidentally caught in fishing net, nets, and uh, the, it was a decision made to um, try and preserve the shark and uh, display it so uh, people could learn about it, kids could see uh, what a great white shark look like and uh, for s somehow the shark made its way out to this uh, wildlife park where it's been sitting for uh, a very very long time now apparently uh, that the uh, the vandals have probably damaged the tank so bad that it's actually leaking now this the liquid in it i can't remember what they call it pathanolite or something like that is very very toxic uh, very harmful um, to humans uh, but uh, it, it's used to somehow preserve uh, the shark inside. But because the, the tank's been damaged, um, the shark is starting to uh, uh, decay a bit and that, which is very disappointing. Uh, apparently it's uh, unable to move it um, due to the, uh, the tank being damaged. So uh, it's very sad to see that this shark is just sitting out there now, just in, in the middle of nowhere. Now, I'm not sure, like I said before, where this place is, but it's somewhere in the countryside, uh, out in the urban areas. Um, and uh, it was just amazing that uh, uh, these guys actually came across it. It would have been quite eerie. It's, it's actually quite eerie actually seeing the video. So uh, what I'll do, I'll link these videos in the description bar down below so you can go check them out for yourself. But uh, it's very sad to know that this shark has just been left there to... Uh, it's a rot, basically, and uh, I don't think there's anything that can be uh, done about it, which is very sad. So, But uh, I just wanted to obviously um, do a video on this because uh, this is uh, stuff I talk about on my channel. And uh, if you've seen this going around on uh, social media, um, that's, uh, uh, that's the story behind it. So uh, it's a four-metre female great white shark called Rosie. She's been there since 1998 and uh, she was only just found recently abandoned in this uh, wildlife park that's pretty much uh, like a ghost town. So, all right, guys, that, that's it for this video. Thank you for tuning in. Uh, drop a comment down below. Like I said, I will link these videos in the description bar down below so you go check them out. Uh, make sure you hit that like button, subscribe to, to the channel, and I'll see you in the next video.